The environment is really important, but so also is our energy security. But we don't believe in the ECR that any energy mix should be taken off the table, that everything should be put out there, and that every member state doesn't need to have exactly the same energy policy because it has different climates, also different historical uh, realities that it needs to deal with. So we don't believe a one-size-fits-all policy is absolutely concrete in this area, but we need to look at every option to make sure that we can get the best service at the best prices for all of the EU citizens. Well, for the Liberal group in the European Parliament, it's very important that we become energy independent. This is not only important for fostering more sustainable energy sources, but also to become independent of other geopolitical players like Russia or Saudi Arabia, to mention a few, which uh, create a dependence for the EU, which we don't need. So energy independence and fostering renewables and sustainable energy is a win-win that we should go for. We will continue to fight for an um, energy efficiency system in European Union because the more efficient energy is used, the more we can save and the more energy is also available. And of course we have to build smart grid system in Europe. Most important for Europe is that we have a portfolio of actions on greenhouse gas reduction, renewable energy and energy savings. All that together, that is very important to tackle. For example, the EU is importing now more than 400 million euros a year by importing fossil fuels. By reducing that amount, our economy gets stronger, we tackle environmental issues and we are more secure on our own energy. And we do that by renewables, efficiency and of course less greenhouse gas emissions. That's the key. I think first of all, is it important to have a diversity of our energy resources so that we do not rely on one country, one region as well. Secondly, we have to find a balance between uh, the sufficiency of energy and the environmental questions. And this has to be done to prices which are achievable. And to find this balance, I think it's a very important question. And then thirdly, I believe we should do here more on a European level all these questions, interconnectivity of our energy supply, the joint foreign energy policy, which we have not done enough until now, and I believe we should also find the possibility to work for more renewable energies to achieve our prices, which makes it possible also to be less dependent on foreign energy resources.